Hey, it's Jen from Oil in My Lamp. This is my daughter, Emma. Say hi. Hi. I am coming to you from our pantry. Now, your pantry may look different than my pantry, um, and that's fine. What is important in our lesson series is that we have the same idea of what a pantry is for, and that is that we can just grab what we need so easily when we are preparing a meal. We don't have to run out to the store, search for it, find it, and then bring it home and finish up that meal at 8 p.m. when your kids really need to be in bed. So why we're in front of the pantry is that our spiritual life can have a pantry as well. We are able to put God's Word into our hearts and our minds so that in those times of distress, disappointment, heartache, um, even in those times of joy and excitement and happiness, we are able to grab onto God's Word and have it right at hand. So join me in the pantry every other week, mostly, uh, through 2017. And we're going to start with our session right now. I'm glad you stayed tuned. So how this is going to work is I'm going to kind of present a lesson to you on the second and fourth weeks of the month. And then if you'll click the like button on this post, you'll be able to see all the things that I provide for you um, between sessions. So I'll be providing some little pictures that you can put on your phone to remind you of the verse that we're studying. I'll be reminding you with some videos, with some possibly some more live videos just to remind you of our verse together. And then at the end of that two weeks, we should have been able to put that verse into our hearts so that when a need arises, we'll be able just to grab it from our spiritual pantry. So for today, I have a verse for you that has really touched my heart recently. It is from Psalm 118, verse 5 and 6. And I apologize, I have my Bible over here. Psalm 118, verses 5 and 6. And the reason that I liked this verse so much was because of these specific words. It says, the Lord is on my side. And I have one of those awesome journaling Bibles. And I want to show you what I put in there. Isn't it when we are feeling um, stress from the world, stress from um, people disagreeing with us, stress from um, not being able to um, connect our faith to what the world is saying. And so you feel in discord. Isn't it at that time when you just need a cheerleader, when you just need somebody to be beside you, and it just so happens that God is there. So Psalm 118, I want to show you this. In my Bible, I have written, the Lord says, go Jen. And that might be backwards in the camera. I don't know, we'll find out. Um, the Lord says, Go, Jen. And the verse actually says, Out of my distress I called on the Lord. The Lord answered me and set me free. The Lord is on my side. I will not fear. What can man do to me? So let's just take apart this verse for one, one minute. He says, Out of my distress I called on the Lord. Definitely a stressful situation. But if you look at these words, you understand that David feels like he is in this tight space. And the next part of the verse says, the Lord answered me and set me free. And if you look at different versions, you'll see this word that God set him in a, in a big place. So I feel like David is like squished and tight in here. And then all of a sudden the Lord has allowed him freedom. Freedom from uh, torment, freedom from someone chasing after him. Isn't it true? David was constantly being chased after. And then it goes on to say in verse 6, the Lord is on my side. And that reminds me of that verse in Hebrews chapter 13, verse 6, where the writer says something along the lines of, um, I will not fear what man shall do to me, because the Lord is so much greater than man could ever be. So our verse for these two weeks is from Psalm 118, verses 5 and 6, 
and here let's repeat it again out of my distress I called on the Lord the Lord answered me and set me free the Lord is on my side I will not fear what can man do to me thanks for joining me today in my pantry I hope you'll like this video so you can keep up with what I've got for you the next two weeks to help us to really memorize this verse or at the very least to memorize that God is for you and is saying go sister have a great day bye hi ladies this is Emma from all in my lamp subscribe to our YouTube channel like our Facebook page goodbye <laughs>